So today we are in the hydrogen centre at Altona. Um, this is part of our arena supported project. Uh, we're in the educational component right now. And um, outside we've got some of the equipment has uh, just been installed and uh, we'll go through the commissioning stages uh, very soon. The equipment itself has a, uh, it's an electrolyzer. that's the cornerstone of our program, the ability to make hydrogen um, using electricity to split water. In addition to the electrolyzer, we have to be able to store it. So we've got a large storage vessel. Uh, we've got multiple storage vessels at low pressure and, uh, and also at, at, at higher pressure. We will include a, a commercial grade refueling station, which is being uh, constructed as we speak. And there's also a fuel cell, a 30 kilowatt fuel cell, that's going to be able to provide energy back to the buildings. The electrolyzer itself is capable of making around 80 kilograms of hydrogen per day. Our target is to make around the, um, around the 60 kilogram mark and we want to use as much green energy as possible. Fuel cell cars in particular, like the Mirai just to my left, are a, a vehicle that is electric, however it uses a fuel cell to power the, the vehicle uh, instead of having a large battery. Um, from Toyota's perspective, we see that as a great opportunity to um, uh, decarbonise and reduce emissions. Um, mobility obviously only makes up a very small component of that, of that larger hydrogen economy. And we see a place for multiple um, electrification technologies, whether it be hybrid or, or battery electric or fuel cell electric, um, to contribute to that overall goal. So hydrogen is, is a, uh, a technology that allows you to refuel ex extremely quickly, quite similarly to a, a, a traditional um, a petrol or diesel vehicle. And that gets you a range of another 500 to 550 k's out of this particular car. There are safety um, protocols inside the car. We've got hydrogen sensors. We've got um, two very, um, very secure and very tough hydrogen storage tanks. And it's multi-layered. So we've got a, uh, it's carbon fiber and it's, it's fiberglass. And, it's extremely strong. Um, Toyota is a, a founding member and board member of the uh, Australian Hydrogen Council. Um, Arena's funded a number of projects uh, from members inside that, um, that company. Um, Gemina, for example, and ATCO, a BOC up in, um, up in Queensland are also running a project there. The other areas that um, Arena's focused on is, is export and how does that um, become a next, the next um, export for Australia, being the ability to export our, our sunshine, essentially, as solar energy. Um, to markets that actually need that, um, that energy and aren't able to produce it all themselves.